I'm Annie. And I'm Holly. From the Youth Room at the BB Library. And welcome to our brand new program, Sing Along Stories. We're so glad that you could join us for this. Now, Sing Along Stories are, well, they're kind of exactly that, stories that you can sing along to. Now, some stories actually started out as songs and were made into books. So the words in the books are the words of the story, or as we say in music, the lyrics. So we'll read the story. And sing the song. And guess what? You can join in. Or just sit back and enjoy. So today for our first ever sing-along story, we are going to be reading and singing to Puff the Magic Dragon. Now the book, Puff the Magic Dragon, that I have right here, uh, was written by Peter Yarrow and Lenny Lipton. And the artwork in the book was done by Eric Puibere. But the song, Puff the Magic Dragon, was written and sung by a folk group called Peter, Paul, and Mary. And uh, Peter Yarrow is the Peter of Peter, Paul, and Mary. Ollie, did you know the song Puff the Magic Dragon before we read the book together? I did. My parents didn't have very much music at our house, but one thing they did have, they had two albums of Peter, Paul, and Mary. Let me show you. I found one of them. This is in there. Oh, they awesome. And um, a long time ago, before, it was it's actually a um, vinyl record, and I especially love to sing along with the song Puff the Magic Dragon. What about you, Annie? Did you know the song before? I did, yeah. I grew up listening to Peter, Paul, and Mary. Um, my mom actually had that album you just showed us as a CD, um, and my mom loved playing their music. And one year, my mom and I saw Peter, Paul, and Mary in concert, at the North Shore Music Theater. And I remember they played the song, Puff the Magic Dragon, and they invited everyone in the audience to sing along with them. And it was really special to sing that song, to see them in concert, and especially for me to be there with my mom who introduced me to their music. Well, speaking of music, how about we share the words to the song's chorus now? The chorus? Oh, um, yes. There are different parts of songs. There's like verses and there's choruses. A verse is the part that tells us the story. And the chorus is a repeated theme, like a repeated set of words that keep going throughout the song. So why don't you let me play the chorus of Pup the Magic Dragon? Yeah. Okay. All right. It goes like this. And this is the part that gets repeated. It goes... Pop the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Pop the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. That's a chorus. That was awesome. Thank you so much for sharing that, Holly. So now that we know the chorus, I guess we'll find out what happens in the story from the verses, like you said, because those are what tell the story, right? Right. So the book is going to use the verses to the song, the song lyrics, as the story. So we will see the verses, we'll see what's happening to Puff on this adventure, and we'll also see that familiar Puff the Magic Dragon chorus throughout as well. So let's go ahead and jump in and get started and hear the story of Puff the Magic Dragon. Puff the Magic Dragon by Peter Yarrow and Lenny Lipton with paintings by Eric Puibere. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Little Jackie Paper loved that rascal Puff and brought him strings and sealing wax and other fancy stuff. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Together they would travel on a boat with billowed sail Jackie kept a lookout perched on Puff's gigantic tail. Noble kings and princes would bow whene'er they came. Pirate ships would lower their flag when Puff roared out his name. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. 
Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. A dragon lives forever, but not so little girls and boys. Painted wings and giant's rings make way for other toys. One gray night it happened, Jackie Paper came no more. And Puff, that mighty dragon, he ceased his fearless roar. His head was bent in sorrow, green scales fell like rain. Puff no longer went to play along the cherry lane. Without his lifelong friend, Puff could not be brave. So Puff, that mighty dragon, sadly slipped into his cave. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the magic dragon. Annie, it sounds like you're ready for some music. Absolutely. But before you sing the song, Holly, do you think you could remind me of all of the words to the chorus and the tune of it so I can better sing along with you? Sure, yes. Okay, you ready? Yeah. There. <laughs> Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Nice. Yeah, I, I think we're ready for the whole song now. Yes! Right. Holly, this is going to be just like when I saw Peter, Paul, and Mary in concert at the North Shore Music Theater, except it's going to be completely different. <laughs> okay, we're ready to hear the whole song together, and I hope you join me on the chorus. And you can always tell when the chorus is going to start because we'll have... Oh, puff. And so you hear that, oh, puff, and that's the only place it appears. It's just before the chorus starts again. So here's... The whole thing. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Little Jackie Paper loved that rascal Puff and brought him strings and sealing wax and other fancy stuff. Oh, Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Together they would travel on a boat with billow sail. Jackie kept a lookout perched on Puff's gigantic tail. Noble kings and princes would bow when e'er they came. Pirate ships would lure their plagues when Puff roared out his name. Oh, Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. A dragon lives forever, but not little boys and girls. Painted wings and giant rings make way for other toys. One gray night it happened, Jackie Paper came no more. And Puff the mighty dragon, he ceased his fearless roar. His head was bent in sorrow, green scales fell like rain. Puff no longer went to play along the cherry lane. Without his lifelong friend, Puff could not be brave. So Puff, that mighty dragon, sadly slipped into his cave. Oh, Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist a land called Hanali. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali.
Thank you so much for reading. And singing. Along to Puff the Magic Dragon with us. It's pretty fun to mix books and music together, isn't it? It is. We should do this again sometime. Yeah, definitely. And I hope that you can join us again for more sing-along stories. Happy reading. And singing. <laughs> See you later. The magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land.